from the bottom of my heart. Thank you guys so much. Eyes in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my hand to the fire, but it's no use. Cause you can't stop it from shining through. So as you guys know, I was supposed to go into the field today. And so I left my wife and it was definitely sad because I had to be gone for like four days. But I found out I'm actually not going to the field until tomorrow morning. So I actually get to spend tonight with my wife, which is awesome, which is really cool because I kind of get to surprise her in a way because me coming home, like she doesn't expect me to be home tonight. So I'm headed home and I'm gonna be home and get to spend this evening with her, which is gonna be awesome. She's probably gonna be like totally like freaked out when she like sees me because she won't really know how to respond, but it should be pretty awesome. I love you. You look so hey, 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 hey. Oh. You look so pretty. Oh. It's so good to see you. Are you excited I get spend the evening with you? I am so excited. Yeah. Oh. Well, I love you. Like the doggies were acting weird. I was like, is Harold home? <laughs> so I got up. I had to come see my red, you know? Oh. I love you. I love you. Let's hang out. We are taking a family trip to the post mm -hmm. office. Got the puppies in the back. <laughs> they always like to go they on rides. It, like, they know it. I say, want to go for a ride? And they freak out. I think it's mostly not because they want to go for a ride because they don't want to get left get out home. Yeah. Exactly. So, we're going to check the mail. We haven't checked in a while. So, hopefully, we got a few letters from you guys that we can read um, and respond to. All right, you guys. A little bit of an update here. I'm still in the car with the puppies. So, um, that hasn't changed. But, so yesterday, Harold ended up coming home, which was really exciting. And he didn't have to leave until this morning, which I was very grateful for because my back was hurting so bad I started to feel nauseous again it was just one of those nights um so if he wasn't home then I probably would have just been feeling really bad by myself and then missing him and it just probably would have ended in some tears so instead I got to feel bad but he got to be there to like comfort me and, and, and everything um but anyways he left this morning and so I brought the pups with me I'm actually at Caitlin's house and they're gonna play with Abrams in the backyard have some puppy time and we are going to hopefully get in the pool and maybe that will help my back I really hope so um because it's just hurting really bad so we'll see oh my gosh I wish Harold was here I have to pee so bad but I'm not gonna miss this moment I mean, I could take my phone and camera to the bathroom, but y'all don't want to. <laughs> y'all don't. Ah! We did it! Oh my gosh! Ah! Okay, got a screenshot. Got a screenshot. Got a screenshot. Oh, I missed it! I missed it! I got it with the one. I kind of want to lose a, su a subscriber so I can. No, I don't actually want to lose you, subscriber. I appreciate you, whoever you are. Don't go away. I can't even believe it. I mean, I can believe it, but like, I can't stop smiling. I was driving home from my friend Caitlin's house. We, I spent the day over with her and the puppies and we're swimming and just had a really good day. I got some sun too, like, ooh. Um, but then you know we were tired it's like what time is it right now 9 45 at night before i left i checked you know the subscriber count and it was like we we're like 20 away and she lives about 30 minutes away from me so i was like okay like i'm, I'm still gonna try you know because i was getting tired the puppies were tired so i drive home and you guys like my eyes were just like filling up with tears like as i was driving home just thinking about how amazing this community has been for this like two and a half years um and how it's helped me grow as a person and how cool it is the connections that we've been able to make um and just hearing y'all stories and i don't know just like all this stuff and and like just just to know like god has been so incredibly faithful i don't know it just like it's been so cool it's been so so cool um but i really wish harold was home i can't even call him actually so that's a little bit of a bummer although he knew it would probably happen today or at least while he was gone um so i bet he's thinking about it right now i bet he's like i wonder if we hit it so i did text him but i know he's not even gonna get the text not gonna lie you guys i'm like really emotional right now <laughs> Woo. And I'm sure I could like cry my way through um, trying to share my thoughts like normally I do. But honestly, I kind of just want to go to bed and um, cuddle with my puppies and celebrate with them in a weird way um, since Harold's not here. But um, just from the bottom of my heart, thank you guys so much um, for supporting. <laughs> I don't want.
want to do this for supporting um me and harold um and just us sharing our lives um it's it's amazing and i just feel really thankful and thankful for this community um i will collect myself <laughs> and talk to you guys tomorrow <laughs> but uh yeah i'm gonna get some rest but thank you guys and i just can't wait to see where this community grows um harold and i have some big plans um for ways that we want to continue to make a difference um and we just want to impact your your lives um as much as we possibly can so um as this channel grows and our community grows um there are hopefully going to be awesome things that happen um in ways that we can really um get to know you guys and impact your life on a more personal level so um the future is bright and yeah i'll talk to you guys tomorrow all right, you guys, so it's actually not even the next morning. It's the following morning after that. So some time has passed, so this vlog is a little bit weird, but I have a surprise for you. Harold's home! <laughs> Only for a few hours. Well, I, and then he's leaving, spending then the coming night. back, spending the night, and then leaving again. It's complicated. But Yay, so exciting! Since I've been home, one, my wife looks super beautiful, but I'm pretty sure that her belly has grown like three inches horizontal. <laughs> like, he's gotten it's big, he really is. It's has. getting bigger every day. He's gotten so much bigger. Time to go get some lunch. Girls fam, all right, so we were just celebrating <laughs> some things. But anyway, we were talking afterwards, and I had an interesting question. It like, what age can your kids, like, not be in the room when they're doing parent things you know like like a baby All like ages. well like a one month old right they're just kind of like in their crib right that's like okay but like when is it like weird you know what been kissing me <laughs> we got mama rocking in a rocking chair over here <laughs> You're like super weird. Hey, so this is awesome. So I got home. I like have like what my seven hour pass, if you will, and then I had to go back. But Rachel shared some amazing news with me. So as I was getting out of the field, I started getting text messages. And what is so cool is that we hit a hundred thousand subscribers as an Earls fan, which is absolutely amazing. Like I was like smiling home. Like I thought it was literally and still do the most amazing thing um yeah he came home and he's like did we do it did we do it he's like i saw your text so i was like yeah we hit it so for me like what i think is so amazing about it is several things one i want to point out first and foremost like my wife like the amount of hard work like see i, I feel like sometimes you know you don't necessarily know i mean a lot of people don't i don't even know like how much work goes into these videos like you know you guys get to watch them and i get to watch them you know and partake in them but she puts in hours and hours of work to make them happen which is I'm just so thankful because we get to go back and see our memories. We get to see our stories. We get to see our, you know, baby boy grow up because she puts in all these hours. So definitely give her a huge, huge thanks because honestly, like all of this, like 100,000 subscribers is because of you guys. <laughs> because of you. One, two, three. <laughs> because of baby boys <laughs> boobies. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and then Earl's fam, whether you're new, whether it's today that you subscribe, whether it's literally you've been with us from day one, like the first hundred subscribers, like I hope that you guys can feel that we have a really special community. And I felt that no matter the size that it's grown to, 100,000 now versus 1,000, 10,000, it's pretty amazing to see the amazing people and really just genuine and caring people that the Earl's fam community is. So big thanks to you guys because you guys really are amazing. And honestly, like, you you like make our lives so much better like we love reading your comments and and seeing the interaction um and just seeing the love that you guys have um is it, pretty special and, and honestly like we feel grateful just to like be a part of it it's cool because it's like you know we're not celebrating this crazy number you know it's like we're celebrating these people you know right. you guys and it's it's interesting i think on an individual level you guys know whatever the vlogs mean to you but we get to hear from everybody like the messages i get all the time the stories that you guys share with me like that is why we get excited as the community grows as it hits a like new milestone it's like it's so powerful because it's like 
you know, just knowing that those are people, you know, it, it's not yeah. about, it's a not number, about us. Right. It's not about like a number. It's about the people. And, and every time, you know, God, I've been discouraged over and over. Um, and I got really emotional when I hit a hundred thousand <laughs> subscribers or we hit it, um, for a couple reasons. Uh, one, just thinking about, wow, like this community is so much bigger than, you know, I, imagined and just like the impact it's been able to have um but it was a long road getting there as well and i guess that's something i wanted to share with you guys is you have to believe in yourself like first and foremost um like it's really cool now it's like harold's my like story and you know from the beginning it kind of was too um but in the beginning it was hard you know he always supported me but a lot of people really were confused by what i was doing um and didn't really understand so just first and foremost you have to believe in yourself um and just don't give up on whatever it is if you have a vision like stick to it and i promise like good things can come out of it just stay faithful keep going after it um I'm so glad that I did stick like through it after the different times that I have gotten discouraged. And I want to say thank you to you guys because every time that I did get discouraged, I would get a personal message, someone sharing with me their story or like how the vlog or how the saying, you know, love God, love people, make a difference, be thankful has become a part of their daily life. And that is what fuels me, you know, like that keeps me going. Um, so it's really cool. Like one of my favorite things to do is like read letters or read comments because it, it just makes it real like I mean you watching you know this video right now like you have a a personal story right everyone has their own struggles or what they're going through and it, it's each one is different from the other right so you watching this is different from someone else watching it but that's what makes this so cool to us is is that we can reach out and directly connect with you watching you know so it's just so amazing to us I don't know it's just it's really cool. It's really, really cool on so many levels. You know, it's cool for us because we get to document our lives and we get to kind of help build this community. But it's cool for you guys in whatever way that it has individually As affected. Impact, right? Exactly. You know, so like I'm it makes me so excited because of how far we've come from the beginning, how much I've grown as an individual, how many memories we've captured, how many people the community has been able to reach and to think like wow, like if we keep this going, like how it can continue to grow, continue to impact people. And I briefly mentioned it the other night, um, how, you know, Ooh, my we arm's getting tired of <laughs> holding the camera. I don't know, we're getting on the soapbox over here. <laughs> it's something here and I haven't talked to you guys a lot about, um, and we will sometime in the future, but we have a really big vision for this community um, and other ways that we want to like make a difference in your lives um, on a much larger scale um, that hopefully will- Don't share too much. No. I, I'm not, I'm not, but just, um, you know, as, as long as God continues to be faithful and this continues to be something that he wants us to do, um, then yeah, there's exciting things to come in the future. So it, it makes me really excited. <laughs> Well, I think we're, we're off our soapbox, but uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah we, we love you, Rose fam. We, we always, always, always are so grateful for you. And as, as, as always, it will never change, but love God, love people, make a difference, and be thankful today. We love you, Rose fam. Love you guys. Hey, and click subscribe, by the way, if you haven't. <laughs> we'll, we'll see, see y'all later. Next video.